Star Season Alpha 3.18 just hit wave three. That's open PTU. That means everybody has access to the PTU to test out 318. What does that mean? This means we are very close to a live release. This is just a general test to see how the server handles the load. And after this test, we're looking at a live build for Star Citizen Alpha 3.18. And I'm really excited, all right? Um, so I just wanted to give you guys that quick update. Also, um, there's some new information about the new variant for the RSI Scorpius. I think it's called the Scorpius Antares and it is a really cool looking ship it looks the same but it just doesn't have the turret at the top it has um, a slot in the middle in replacement of the turret for either a qed or an emp so there's two options that you can install on the scorpius as it looks right now there's what we call the tide lock qed this is a quantum enforcement device by rsi and it's a size three it says the tylock quantum enforcement device was internally designed by robert space industry specifically for the scorpius and Taris. the carefully crafted design contains both a quantum snare for pulling crafts out of quantum travel and a quantum dampener for preventing quantum drives activation that is really cool so this is going to be the ship you're going to use um to catch big ships and keep them down okay so that's going to be really interesting being a heavy fighter as it is um so i think because it's missing the turret it's not going to have the extra four guns but it's still going to have the four i think size uh three slots on the tips of the wings okay so the other device is called the mag strand emp generator so now this is a burst generator by rsi and it's a size four so if this is actually designed for the scorpius that means the scorpius can hold up to a size four device that's interesting okay so it says the mag strand for rsi is an emp burst generator designed specifically for the scorpius and taurus okay good when fully charged, the device creates a powerful wave of distortion damage that can disable electronic components within its blast radius. That is really cool. So now when the Scorpius, the idea of the Scorpius came out, I had a feeling that it's going to have an EMP. I don't know if you guys remember that video. I said, man, this thing's going to have a some sort of EMP device for it. I said it, right? It's a Scorpius right it could sting scorpius scorpions in real life sting so I'm, I'm like when the ship came out it's gonna have some special functionality to be able to stop you or to be able to disable you all right and here we go all right so you guys let me know your thoughts on this down in the description below i will see you on the next one